What is a letter testamentary and how do you get one? My name is Laura Hurd and I'm an attorney who has practiced probate and family law in San Antonio, Texas for 35 years. And recently a young woman came to my office and she was asking for me to write a letter because the bank had told her that she needed a letter testamentary in order to access her deceased mother's bank account. Now, that name, letter testamentary, is very misleading because it's not a letter at all. A letter testamentary is actually a certificate that you get from the probate clerk or the county clerk, depending on what county the will was probated in. And that certificate certifies that on file at the courthouse, there is an order signed by the judge admitting the will to probate and that you have been sworn in and qualified to be executor of the estate. Now, the only way to do that is actually to file a lawsuit. And most people cannot do that without an attorney because there are many steps and many documents that have to be prepared and a court hearing to go through. And you have no way of knowing what it is that you have to do in order to get all of that done. It's not an easy process. There's really no step by step or no instructions or anybody to help you through the process. You're presumed to know how to do it and so most people have to hire an attorney who knows how to do it. You have to do an application with all the right things that meet the statute included in the application, pay the filing fee, set a hearing, give notice of citation, and at the hearing prove certain things with testimony, and then have the uh, judge sign an order, which you or your attorney has to prepare ahead of time, and then you have to take an oath and you have to have the written oath ready to go prepare that ahead of time. You get sworn in and then you are in charge of the estate. And at that point, then the clerk can issue you letters testamentary. But if you've never been in charge of an estate before, you've probably never heard the term letters testamentary. It's a very common issue. If you need a letter testamentary, I have 35 years experience getting those and I would be happy to discuss it with you. I'm Laura Hurd.